Sponsored by RxCardClub.com. Get a free prescription drug card and save up to 85% on prescription drugs. RxCardClub.com. Steve Spurrier claims Sharoni Moore doesn't have much of a chance after Jim Harbaugh departure, that coach, he doesn't have much of a chance with what Harbaugh left him, Spurrier said. 13 from one team drafted, and something like 8 on defense, 9 on offense, or something like that. So it'll take them a while to get back to a team like they had last year. That's for sure. Click here to go to prize picks and use code N3 to receive a guaranteed $50 once you play $5 in lineups. Michigan lost 13 players in the NFL draft this offseason, the most in college football. Moreover, head coach Jim Harbaugh left the program and took secondary coach Steve Klinkscale, defensive line coach Mike Elston and defensive coordinator Jesse Minter with him. To make matters worse, Sharoni Moore is battling the repercussions of the sign-stealing cheating scandal that rocked the Wolverines last season. Michigan's setbacks were obvious in its 31-12 loss to Texas in Week 2. The Wolverines committed three turnovers in the loss. Michigan's defense wasn't much better, allowing Texas to amass 389 total yards. Watch college football games live try for free Fubo. Click here now. Save $30 on your first month of Fubo by clicking here now. For a limited time, you can get your first month of Fubo for as low as $49.99. Stream ESPN, ABC, CBS, Fox, NBC and 200 plus top channels of live TV and sports without cable. Participating plans only. Taxes and fees may apply. Dees of offense and convert 10 of its 16 third down attempts. Perhaps Michigan's most significant issue on Saturday was its lack of a strong quarterback performance. The team started former walk on Davis Warren behind center over competing QB Alex Orgy. In the loss, Warren tallied 204 passing yards and one touchdown but threw two interceptions. Spurrier believes Michigan must solve its issues at QB before it can find success this season. Michigan was playing with a kid, Spurrier said, referring to Warren. He might have been a walk-on, who earned a scholarship, and he's their guy now, but he can't move. And you got to be able to bounce around from the rush a little bit. Warren only suffered one sack in the loss but still struggled to find a rhythm. On Saturday, Michigan will have a chance to recompose itself when it squares off against Arkansas State at noon ET. Jeroni Moore hasn't lost faith in his team. Yeah, I think the big thing is just everybody doing their job, players, coaches, Moore said. We all got to be better together. That was the message to everybody after the game, Moore continued. We're not going to point fingers and say it was this person, or this person. Collectively, we've got to be better as a whole group, whole unit, offense, defense, special teams.